Education Ministry and universities have called on students to end violent and disruptive fees must fall protests. Minister Bladen Zimande and Vice Chancellors met in Kempton Park, east of Johannesburg, yesterday. They revealed that universities affected by the protests have suffered damages worth more than 150 million rand. Another roundtable meeting to defuse tensions on campuses and tackle the funding crisis. But massive damages at institutions countrywide as 2015 drew to a close, a sore point. Arson responsible for most of the damage. We can't afford more damage to institutional assets. Our preliminary damage report suggests an estimated 150 million rands of damage to public property last year. Universities are set on avoiding a repeat and also want to protect staff and students. The only reason those security, uh, private security have been brought on is because registration was being prevented. The National Student Financial Aid Scheme has scheduled a briefing on the 2016 budget allocations and additional funding. For this year, 2016, the criteria that NASPA supplies is going to remain as it is. The new model, however, is not addressing just the funding issues for the missing middle. It's addressing the funding issues for poor students and missing middle. A new funding model is expected to be rolled out from next year. Nozindombi Mia, SABC News, Kempton Park.